Yeah, my name G Herbo. G Herbo. I like nasty bitch. I like classy bitch. Look fake sassy bitch. I got ratchet bitch. Bossed up bad bitch. Foreign swag bitch. Alright, bro, Stab man, Stab Breezy back in the building one time. Ooh, what am I saying? I'm not Stab Breezy. Who am I? I'm Range Gang, you feel me? Stab got range, man. Welcome back to another video. I'm finna tell y'all a story time of my first day of college. My first day of college experience. The shit was tragic, but it was overall alright. I mean, I met, I, I seen up, you know, I met up with a couple people that used to go to my old high school because we all go into what I started. I'm, I'm in a community college, so that means, like, people from different... People from the district, but coming from different schools, are pretty much going to the same community college that we are all in. So people, a few people came from my school into that same college as well, and they was coming in, and they was my friends and whatnot. So we all ended up in the same pathway, you feel me? So I met up with a couple of them. You know, it's pretty fun, but... Hey, the class that I ran into, I, all y'all know is I walked into the wrong classroom. I'm going to tell y'all what classroom this fucking was. So look, let's start off with the day. I got to wake up in the morning because that's how my schedule works out. I chose morning classes because, hey, I'm able to go to school in the morning. I get out at about 12 on Mondays, and then I could go back home until like 4 or 5. Uh, probably go to sleep, take a nap, do a video or something like that. You know, shit that I'm doing right now, I'm making a video for y'all on my free time. But then I gotta go to work sometimes, uh, depending on what day it is. I gotta go to work at like four or five, so hey, I only get a couple like hours to be at home. So, look, this is how my day went on. Yesterday was the first day. August 21st was the first day of college. This is the 22nd. I'm speaking on what happened yesterday. So, this is what happens. I wake up, go to school, you know, get my schedule ready. I walk into, you no, know, I drive to the place. I've been up here for a couple times because I registered my classes up there. And I had orientation up there at the school, at the college. And it's like, alright, I kind of know a little bit, like, my way around. We ain't take no tour of that damn big-ass campus. It's not as big as, like, a UIC or a Duke or fucking... You feel me? Florida University type campus. But it's like, you know, it's just it's still a big campus that you, you know, you can't take a tour of. Because, my nigga, that shit long as hell. No homo. But look, I drive up there, you know, the parking lot's full as hell. I'm trying to find me a parking spot. I park in the fucking, I park furthest away from, for some damn odd reason, I park the furthest away from my classes. And I got to find my car at the end of the day when I get out of school. And I'm over there lost looking for it, walking around for 10 minutes. Because, mind you, I don't got no panic alarm, no none of that shit on my keys. So, I'm like, dang, I just parked so far away. I don't know where I was parking. Like, this is my first time literally driving up to the school and parking on my own. So, yeah. First day shit, man. Mistakes. Mistakes happen. But, hey, first two classes happen, man. If y'all plan on going to college or anybody that's in high school that wants to go to a college, university, you call your teachers professors now. Them niggas lecture for about, and you know, 50 minutes to an hour. Well, the one I'm at, they lecture for like 50 minutes to two hours, depending on how you make your schedule. My nigga, they don't stop talking. I almost wanted to fall asleep and just knock the fuck out in my class because they just talk for so long. And professors, I literally hate them. And it's only been two days of school, including today, my nigga. It's only been two days of school. I already hate them because they just talk so much, but that's their job, so I ain't gotta, I ain't gonna blame them, but I just hate the fact they got, they just gotta talk so damn much, like, I'm finna fall asleep in school, man, it's crazy, right, so, look, first two classes was assessed, you know, we all went through the syllabus and whatnot, y'all know what the syllabus is, right, we just going over this, you know, room policies and shit, the room guidelines, the rules, no cheating, plagiarism, all that shit, we gotta do a signature and whatnot sometimes, yeah, that's what a syllabus is. We had to do that in the first two classes. My last class is I only had three classes yesterday. I got three Monday, two on Tuesday, which was today, uh, three tomorrow on Wednesday, two on Thursday, then one class on Friday. Ooh, Friday. I love Friday, man. One class, only going up there for 50 minutes. Hey, I'm happy. But, yeah, I only had three classes yesterday. I'm like, all right, this is my last class. Let me get a little hype. Let me get a little energetic because, hey, I'm going to be out of here at this. At the end of this class, I'm going to be out of you, feel me, man? So, look, I'm supposed to be going to a marketing class. I chose marketing because that's actually going along with my major. I'm going to be majoring in business, trying to be an entrepreneur. That's my career. And, uh... Yeah, marketing goes along with the major, so I just chose marketing. I'm like, hey, or no, somebody helped me and threw that in there for me. So I'm like, hey, thank you for throwing in marketing. I'm going to have to learn how to do this shit because I want to actually have my own clothing brand. Like, something like Bape and Supreme. Y'all know that shit, you know. But that's out of the story. So, yeah, I got marketing because that's along with my major, and that was the best class chosen for me. So I'm supposed to be going to marketing. My, let me remind you, though. 
uh, the building that I'm in, for some reason, it has... Alright, so there's classrooms. The classrooms, the way it's set up, I got this shit in my notes, right? I got the whole schedule, the map of the whole campus, and my notes, and my phone, my photos, and all that stuff. So look, I go into the building that I'm supposed to be in. But the classrooms are set up like A161 and B161, right? My marketing class, let's just say, I don't remember the real number of it, but let's just say it's A161. I walk into B161 thinking it's my class. I, I literally just saw 161 on my phone. And all right, I see, I walk past one, and I'm like, okay, this is the class I'm supposed to be into. Let me go ahead and go through here. The building that I'm in, I guess it, that it just has many different varieties and portions of classrooms that it's not like a whole marketing building or something like that. But it got marketing in there, psychology, radiology, and all that shit and it also has a sexual orientation class that's the one i walked into why did that have to be the one i walk into a sexual orientation class learning about the sex organs and all that shit how sex works for people that are wanting to major in fucking doctor shit you know feel me they want to learn about how the body works and whatnot i guess that's what i work into you know i walk into i guess i set myself up for this shit but why did it have to be the same room number as marketing? I walked into B161 thinking it was A161, which is where my marketing class was. So I go in and sit down, right? You know, a couple people come in. I'm a little bit early there. Uh, I walk in. It looks like there's a lot of people there, including me, because I guess I'm not supposed to be there. So why don't I just remove myself from the equation and walk out the classroom? Why didn't I think of that when the time came to me? But no, I'm in there still thinking I'm in my marketing class. So I'm like, all right. Let me get out my marketing folder. Let me get out my notebook. I'm going to have to probably take notes. We're going to look into the syllabus. We ain't get a syllabus. So I'm still kind of clueless of what we're going to be doing in this marketing class. I'm still thinking it's marketing. But no, the lady, we get into, she gets into talking, right? She pulls out a deal. She pulls out a deal, though, my nigga. Why do we have dildos in college? I'm like, ooh, my mind's going crazy. I'm going insane. Why do we have dildos in college? She pulls out a dildo because I guess it's supposed to be showing like a representation. Now, I'm not expecting none of these students to be using the fucking dildo. It's niggas in this classroom too, my nigga. Like, look, y'all want to be doctors, nurses, all that stuff? Y'all may, all right, y'all going to have to learn about how the body works. So I'm guessing this is going to be a section or like some type of area that the students are going to be learning about how the man's body private park work you feel me right so i'm like oh i'm in the wrong class what type of market this ain't marketing my nigga where am i gonna be learning about money and finance and shit this don't look like that's a dick right there that don't look like finance to me so i'm like all right um i'm getting a little scared this shit isn't for me this classroom i'm in the wrong one now that i noticed because this might be a little sexual orientation or sexual education learning class and it's not for me i get up i walk out again professors and you know i didn't notice i didn't let y'all notice but professors do not care if you walk out professors literally do not care about you at all in life you feel me they they may say that they want you to email them if you want help but they don't care if you walk out the classroom so i walk out the classroom because i noticed that it isn't for me i didn't even let the teacher know or let the professor know that hey this is the wrong class or i shouldn't be in here i just walked the fuck out because this isn't the class for me i don't want to see a dildo in my face close to my face like that again you feel me so i'm going insane my mind is kind of like you know it's my mind that's like post-traumatic I, I ain't gonna make nah but that is like a little traumatic experience you feel me like damn you just put out a deal though that fast my, like when when the fuck was mar marketing like when did marketing turn like this so i'm like hey i'm gonna just go home because you know we already 20 minutes into the classroom i'm over there waiting for the syllabus to come out i'm waiting for the t uh, professor to explain what the fuck going on but i learned that it is a sexual education class she pulls out a representation of a fucking dick and shit and I'm not gonna, you know, this this isn't me. This isn't what I wanted to major in, you feel me? So I walk out. I'm not even gonna go to my marketing class because I'm already, like, fucking 30 or 40 minutes late since I already, I already waited into the sexual class waiting for some marketing shit to go on. No, this ain't shit for me. So I ended up going home. I ended up messing, like, one class. But, hey, marketing, I'm gonna I'm see you tomorrow, marketing. So I'm hoping to see... I'm going to know what room to walk in, my nigga. So I'm going to know what room to walk in tomorrow. So that's what I wanted to say, man. It was a overall nice day, but that last class, whoa, it fucked me up, man. It fucked my head up. So that's what I wanted to tell y'all, man. Make sure y'all go ahead and be careful what class y'all fucking walk into, my nigga. Make sure you write down the right shit. I wrote down the right shit, but I just 
you know, my, my, my eyes, my mind saw something different and uh, didn't notice the letter in front of the, lum- the number of the classroom. It didn't notice that shit. So, yeah, that's all I want to say, man. Thank y'all for watching. Stav got, ooh. Yeah, thank y'all for listening to the story and watching the video. Woo! And, uh, man, make sure y'all go ahead and stay tuned for more videos coming out by me soon. You know, 2K18 is going to be grind season, you feel me? So, again, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. And if y'all want more story times, go ahead and comment down below. Range Gang story time, I guess. Comment that shit down below. But, hey, we deserve, we deserve a million likes on this video. So, I'm finna head on out of here, man. Click that bell so you get notifications on when I upload a video. And, uh, Range Gang, Gang Gang Kakatu. Hey, 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 hey! Get, get Dexter. Ooh, who texted me? But, hey, I'm out.